Oops. All right. Hey guys. So this video is to show you how to post your discussion boards just in case you haven't already figured it out. You have one due this Sunday, September 4th. So I'm going to show you on show you the steps on how to create a thread and how to respond to your classmates. So the first thing you want to do is open up Blackboard in your browser. So I'm going to go ahead and shrink myself down and open up my browser for you. Of course the first thing we have to do is log into our Blackboard account and then make sure we open up our COM 101 class and again, my view is going to be a little bit different because I'm in instructor mode instead of student mode. Click the discussions tab. And then you are no longer able to see these first two because the due date for them has passed. However, the first one you should be able to see is this one, chapter three, ECT number two. It's worth five points and it's due this Sunday. The instructions are all listed here. But what you're going to want to do is pay attention to this part right here. There's an evaluation in your textbook on page 54 and what you're going to do with that is fill out the evaluation and then just give us the results and then answer these questions based on the results that you got from the evaluation. So go ahead and open up this and there should be an option for you to create a thread. All right, you're going to go ahead and put in a subject line. It doesn't have to be anything really crafty. So I normally just put my name and I'm just going to write something really brief. All right. And then again, just like when submitting, you're submitting your assignments, you need to make sure you press submit. If you press cancel, it will clear. If you press save draft, it saves it in Blackboard Limbo. I never see it. You must press submit. All right. Once you have posted your initial thread, you will be able to see the rest of your classmates who have posted on this discussion. So go ahead and choose a classmate. Right now, I'm the only one who has posted. and then choose a classmate to reply to. All you have to do is press the reply button and type out your reply. Oops. And again, make sure you press that submit button. Hold on. you read that? Okay, so press submit. Ooh, failure to save message. Let's try this again. If you get that error message, I did not plan for that to happen, go ahead and resubmit your response. All right, pressing submit. All right, and that's all I have to do to submit my discussion board. So part of your discussion board, you get four points for the initial post and one point for responding to a classmate. That, with, that is what puts you up to your five points. The other thing that I wanted to put at the end of this video is an extra credit opportunity. Hmm. So, because I'm going to post this on, in the announcements on Blackboard and have it sent out to your Ivy Tech email at addresses immediately, you have until Friday, September 2nd, tomorrow, at 11.59 p.m. to send me an email to my Ivy Tech email address, mkiesler3 at ivytech.edu. Alright, and then once you send me an email, 
I will respond to you, and you must answer a question that I ask you. All right, so one point for sending me the email, one point for responding when I ask you the question. All right, this is to ensure that you are checking your Ivy Tech emails every day. All right, I'm so crafty. All right, I hope this video was beneficial for you again, and I will be posting this on Blackboard momentarily.